Wow. There we go. Okay, so this was the second one um, on, on five. Um, obviously set up and you can see the alignment of the shoulder is much better. Okay, pretty much at the flag. Nice and stable right leg that we would have been working on. Set the club beautifully and then change direction beautifully with the legs. Where you get a lot of your power from. Okay. And then a beautiful square release. And let's see if you go around that. You go around that left leg there. Okay, so beautiful swing, mate. Okay, now if we compare that to the first one you hit, which obviously wasn't a good one. You can see the shoulders, first of all, a little more open, which doesn't help. Okay, but when we get to the top, this right leg locks out a little bit. And obviously that causes a bit of a posture change on the way down. So that movement there of the right knee makes us get closer to the ball and then we can't clear the hips in time and you can see where that club is going to attack the ball from and where that ball is going to go okay so it starts with the setup the control in that right leg and then the clearing around the left leg okay and we just keep going over and over and over hey bud okay um absolutely fantastic out there uh very cool to see you out there for the first time um, the shot, the swing, what we've been working on, the shot execution, when it's, when it's right, it's just unbelievably good, okay. Um, it's probably at about 50-50 right now, like 50% execution, but I feel like at least 20 to 30% of that can be taken care of by that shoulder alignment, okay. So obviously we're trying to build that swing, a perfect circle around the left leg with the face nice and quiet. Okay, and uh, the club in the face following the body. But now, if you aim there, okay, obviously you're not going to go that way because otherwise the ball will go there. Okay, you're trying to sometimes react to a target and then we start to lose our posture and either hit behind the ball or hit the ball out the heel. Okay, so we're going to work really, really hard on getting that shoulder alignment, trusting that posture. Okay, and then obviously from here, not from here, go around. Okay, I just let that ball get in the way. Okay, so try the new process that we started. Okay, try to work the face and try and work the shoulders to line up where we want that ball to start. Okay, the biggest thing for me out there, bud, was, you know, your speed and balance and striking them were really good. The biggest thing for me out there was um, the short game. Okay, short game is pretty, needs a lot of work. Um, a little bit technically, obviously, we touched on the chipping making sure we stay forward and, and not unwinding that right wrist, but rather trusting that torso and that core, okay, to turn through and always, always, always bouncing the club, okay? Um, so start there, but it's the instincts, okay? It's the reading of the lies, it's the reading of the slopes, all that type of stuff. Um, so we've got to start off with green reading, okay? We've got to learn how to read greens, we've got to learn how to read slope, we got to give that a degree of slope, so we're going to work on one, two, and three degree slopes. One being quite flat, two medium, three big slopes. Okay, and then we work upwards in terms of uphill, downhill, and length as to how to make those adjustments for speed and line. Okay, so that's the process we're going to try and put in place. Okay, and then the same comes into chipping once you're striking it correctly. It's all about reading the line, reading the speed that the ball's going to sort of hit the ground, the, the, the green hat, and then how is it going to react and roll out. Okay, so we're going to put all that information together, come to a decision, pick a target, and then execute our technique. Okay, so we have to start there, those instincts are not there. We can find, but I mean, we can find so many shots there. Okay, I want to say 10. That's why I hesitated, that is so much. But I want to say we can find 10 shots there. Okay, so we're going to work really, really hard on that putting and chipping. Um, and try and bring those scores down that match your ball striking and your goal so you look absolutely fantastic. Okay, so that's the plan and we'll get to work with that uh, process, starting that process next week. Thanks again, it was a lack of, uh, lack of morning.